Hey everybody, this is Eric Clark's Travel Videos and I'm here in Budapest. And so I walked around to get a SIM card today and Budapest, I'm sorry, Hungary is one of those countries that requires you to have a passport to get the, the SIM card. So I had to come back, but so I did some walking around just looking for the best kind of SIM card to get and everything else. But I had to go to a bank, I needed to get a roll, I needed to, to get some other things. So I did some money exchanges and that's what I want to talk to you about. So <laughs> Hungary is the land of monster exchanges. Let me show you what we're talking about, shall we? Let's do it. So I got my American TV on, I don't know what that is. But anyway, so this is it. So let's first start with this. These are their dollars, or not dollars, that's 10,000 forint. You see it where it says forint? 10,000. So I went to the bank and the lady told me to withdraw $100,000. And, and I thought, oh my gosh, you're kidding. And so $100,000 really came to $282.24. So 100,000 of their dollars is 282. So it spit out $100,000. Um, and that's, it just seems absolutely crazy to me. I mean, what's, what's in between these? I mean, I, do they round up to the nearest hundred? Anyway, so that's fine. So we've, we've got the, the cash withdraw, 100,000 equals $282. So then I went to the grocery store. And so here's my little grocery store list, Market Street, Kieft, whatever it's called. And so here are the items I bought. And I don't know if you can read those. I bought an apple juice and it was $8.99. And it came to a total of $2.54 for an apple juice which isn't like crazy over the top. Pringles, $14.99, that came to $4.24. That's crazy. Water, 56 cents a roll, just a cheesy little roll was $2.99, which was probably what, maybe 75 cents. Um, but I needed it so I could have my first ham sandwich. I'm starving, I haven't eaten all day, and I think I've walked like five miles already. So there's my sandwich and my beer and my drone and all that stuff. Anyway, so that's it. So. If you come to um, Hungary, make sure you're prepared for the currency exchange, blah, blah, blah. And they said they'll take, some places will take euros, but you don't want to use euros because they just really jip you on the exchange rate. So that's it. Thanks for coming along and uh, onward and upward. I got to go to some card. <laughs> Bye, everybody.